Hey there everyone, welcome back. I don't know if you remember Carson Crimini, the 14 year old who ended up dying of a drug overdose while his friends ended up filming it at the Langley Skate Park. Well get this, it's almost been two years after the Langley teen's death and family wants to know why there's been no charges laid. I mean it's his birthday obviously today, he was gonna be, would have been 16 years old today. Um, I guess I we're still very upset. We're, the saddest part is that we're still waiting for charges to be pressed. The Crown Council still has not press charges. And the message I want to send is what what message is the Crown Council sending to the people out there? Um, what message are they sending to kids? Um, basically, by it's been two years, um, for no charges to be pressed for two years, the message they're sending is that this is okay. That what happened? That to overdose to overdose a minor with a lethal amount of drugs to kill them is acceptable. I completely agree 100%. Somebody needs to be held responsible and accountable for this. Like, there was tons of people there. They ended up coursing or getting Carson to take a bunch of drugs. He ended up overdosing, and they ended up filming it, posting it, and ended up dying, and they ended up leaving him there. You would pray and hope that the police would investigate and find out whoever gave him the drugs or whoever who had the drugs and then charge them and they would be held responsible. And this was the case for many years back in the day from what I understand, but now they no longer do that because from what I understand there's so many overdoses. Like for example, this article says BC reports at least 160 overdose deaths in May. And from what people were telling me on the streets is that the police are no longer investigating overdose deaths or any drug, you know, deaths or stuff like that. I don't know if that's actually 100% true, but from what I understand and what I've heard, they aren't. And it's sad because people like Carson, uh, an innocent kid that wasn't a drug user, ended up getting, you know, taking drugs, overdosing, dying. And now they're not, like, from what I understand, they, they haven't pressed charges for two years. And that's just absolutely ridiculous. And it's sad because I know other people that I know personally that have actually died from drug overdoses and the police didn't even bother investigating it or finding out where the drugs came from and didn't even bother they just closed case and it's just really sad and it's sickening and that's why we have such a huge problem in bc right now but in carson's case this wasn't like i said some drug user this was an innocent kid he got bullied or go to the point that he wanted to be cool with his friends and that he, people that he thought was his friends and took these drugs and ended up dying and that's just completely wrong you figure there'd be charges and this just blows my mind i just want to say my heart my prayers go to carson and his whole entire family his father his grandfather everybody that's been impacted the whole community this is just really sad and a tragedy and i really hope the police do their job and they eventually find somebody and uh hold them responsible and charge them um but they ended up doing a memorial bench for uh carson and it has a anti-bullying message as you can see here says uh, play and be kind they also have a petition that i'll be putting a link in the description below and it's to rename the walnut grove skateboard park to carson Kermini memorial skate park as you can see here it has 3947 signatures and it says uh, we can get up to at least 5,000. so if you want you can go uh, sign that so i just thought i'd do an update on this and it's just really sad that it's been almost two years now and still no charges it really sounds like the police just like concluded their investigation and forgot to tell aaron i'll keep you updated if i come across any more updates please like this video comment down below with your thoughts and opinions about this and please click that subscribe button down below for more thanks for watching everyone stay safe god bless you all take care and peace out